It was a quick in and out for former President Jacob Zuma here in the Escort Correctional Services facility. According to the Acting National Commissioner for Correctional Services, Samuel Tobakale, Zuma arrived here at exactly 6 o'clock in the morning. He was briefly processed and then released in line with a special remission authorized by President Cyril Ramaphosa. Over a week ago, the Constitutional Court ruled in favor of a previous judgment by the Supreme Court of Appeal that found that Zuma's release from this facility was unlawful. Zuma was sentenced to 15 months imprisonment for failing to adhere to a Constitutional Court order that said he must appear and testify before the State Capture Commission. During a media briefing on Friday, Minister for Correctional Services Ronald Lamola added that Zuma had actually benefited from a remission authorized by President Cyril Ramaphosa because he was a low-risk offender. About 9,500 other prisoners were released from the country's prisons nationally. At least 15,000 people on parole and house arrest were also taken off the correctional services system. Those released were previously convicted for non-violent and non-sexual crimes and are considered to be low-risk offenders. According to Lamula, this special remission was meant to address overcrowding in the country's prisons and not necessarily meant to let Zuma off the hook. A presidential convoy transporting Zuma was seen entering his Nkandla homestead just after 9 o'clock on Friday. I'm Kosi Kona Duma, reporting for News 24 in Escort, KwaZulu-Natal.